Hi, this is just a quick video review of the Sully 71 Tribute Series. Uh, what I have here is number three of five that will be made. Um, it is a Spanish cedar neck and body. Um, uh, NOS Chevelle uh, brass hardware. Um, uh, classic habanero uh, pickup set from Grover Jackson. The body paint job uh, was uh, you can see it's reminiscent of Randy Rhodes. The pinstriping was actually done by the gentleman who did the pinstriping on Randy's guitar, uh, Ernie P. Dragon. Probably mispronounced it. Sorry. Uh, it is actually, while it looks black, it's actually a blue-black uh, pearl. And it's on the body and the headstock. And in some lights, you can see it become bluish. You can see with the natural light, kind of makes it almost bluish. Outside, it's 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 really cool to see it change colors. Uh, it is a an ebony fretboard with the hollow block inlays. You can see it's got a great cutaway right here. Sully really sculpted the heck out of that. And the guitar is immensely, it's just, it's resonant, it's light. Um, the neck is great like every Sully guitar I've ever played. Stainless steel frets, brass everywhere. A great tribute to Randy's guitar, and I'm going to put a couple of clips of me playing it as best I can uh, with some distortion and some clean just so you can hear the guitar. Uh, if you haven't had a chance to try uh, one of Sully's 71s, uh, he's getting them into some dealers. If you go to sullyguitars.com, you can check them out. Um, honestly, I just need to figure out when I can afford my next one. So uh, enjoy the playing. Thank you. 